Yeah, I mean, I, I, I haven't played against them and, and I've not seen him play loads, but I've, you know, I've heard a few things from, from some of the players and I chatted to him a little bit. In Indian Wells, early in the year, he's obviously, you know, big personality. Um, you know, he's not a quiet guy. Um, and yeah, he, he's, from what I've heard, he's pretty entertaining on the court in terms of the way that he plays and how he is. Well, I've, I've had uh, hip, uh, hip problems since I was uh, very young. Um, you know, it's not, it's not something new to me. It's just been very sore um, the last few weeks and it was, was giving me quite a lot of <clears throat> trouble moving um, to certain shots and getting into certain positions. Uh, you know, with something like that, a lot of it has to really come from, from the player because you know what, what you can and can't tolerate and, you know, we made the decision on Tuesday that after I hit for a little bit in the morning that I needed to I needed to take a few days break. You know, if I was going to give myself the the best chance to to be ready, it was no use pushing for like three or four more days, making myself worse. I mean, there's there's you know pressure on the, this event because it's you know one of the most important that we play during during the whole year. So. You know, if I, if I wasn't nervous or didn't feel any pressure, then I'd be very worried by that. You know, then I think it's not sure I'd be wanting to keep playing if that was the, the case. I, I want to be nervous. I want to feel the pressure at these these events. And but the, the nice thing about it is that at the end of the the days, like when I leave the courts, I get to you know I can get away from it maybe a little bit more than at some of the the other tournaments um, just because I'm, I'm at home with my family and in my in my own house that's nice